Nowadays a website is really a shop front. And we've always sort of really treated it like a window display that we really want to give people the option to kind of see what we're doing before they come in and really be aware of the pricing to try and break down hidden boundaries behind tailoring, to show everybody the different style options, show as many different cloths as possible, simply to put people at ease before they come through the door. The first stage is uh, the consultation process. A very important part of that process is obviously selecting the cloth. That's really going to determine what the suit looks like. Making it tailoring more modern and accessible but while still being traditional. The great thing about us as a company is we're very forward thinking. We integrate technology into the equation. So when we're going through the design process, the customer, they'll have an on-screen visualisation when we're talking about different design details. We spend a good time with the customer working out what the suit's needed for, whether it's a wedding, whether it's a work suit, because the cloths will need to reflect that. The customer will then get measured. And it's about making, a, you know, accommodating that customer to, you know, to what he wants within our sort of house style. We will then make a pattern for that customer, jacket pattern, trouser pattern, waistcoat pattern, overcoat pattern, whatever it is. So the pattern becomes every customer's blueprint uh, and that's stored on file so any subsequent orders will always be cut off that. And once it's made we then try and turn a flat piece of fabric into a three-dimensional fitting. It's an art form and it takes us about 60 hours to make a handmade suit. We have to amalgamate all the different components of that suit and there are different people involved in the making of it. You do need something extra though to bring the next generation of bespoke clients through the door. And what Cad and Dan is always doing, they're always innovating. I mean, Tweed has got a bit of a staid reputation. You come to Cad and Dan, you're going to see Tweed's cut in exciting colours, exciting designs. It's worn with panache. It gives people a bit of a lift. People come here and they think, wow. Can the Dandy have quite a flexible approach to tailoring? So in my experience, we'll work on a variety of garments using different cloths. We try and get everybody to be involved in everything. I don't really like businesses or you know, companies where you're just going to section the work. That's not to say that I want a coat maker of mine to make the trousers. Everyone has to have their area of skill, but I think it's really important that everybody is very customer facing. You're never too old to learn, you know, it's all about adapting and changing. So, you know, hopefully in 10 years' time we'll be as reactive and as able to change to trends and demands as, as we are today. I can't imagine doing anything else.